I want this to just be the first part. Um, that way it's like super bouncy with all the other drums and the melodies, just like. Today I'm going to show you all the sauce. What is good you guys, welcome to another video, I hope you are doing great. Today we are going to try and make a beat from scratch. I don't know yet what type of beat we are going to make but by the title of the video you will already know. And if you know my videos, we are probably going to try something experimental, fire as well, ambient maybe darkish so that is what something i want to go for maybe we'll see what i'm feeling today before we start i want to say thank you to everyone that tuned in into the live stream last week i streamed twice the first stream had some issues with the mic audio but in the second stream i fixed that so if you want to check those out they are still on my channel for you to watch so i will probably do some more streaming in the future but i'll let you guys know for sure the contest is still running so don't forget to join that you can win like some sweet prizes and stuff some kits i'm working on a new one shot kit as well that i might drop this week i'm not sure yet but this is the artwork but enough talking if you are new to the channel don't forget to subscribe yes you right there hit the subscribe button if you want to learn like how to make beats and stuff or just like spark some inspiration this channel is really good for you so don't forget to subscribe let's just dive right into the video so i'm going to find a sound inside of contact that i like then i'm going to lay down some chords and then build off of that Right here I want to do like a triplet um, with like the velocity going up, so let's try that. that is sounding sweet i got a good feeling about this so let's just render that out and add some more melodies and i'll probably add some effects later So we got a nice pattern going on with the guitar, but I wanted to make it a bit more interesting. I'm going to add some extra notes by making it slide up and down. Um, so how you do that is just like place a note, double click, and then go to this icon and click it. Make sure like this is like highlighted and then click on accept. And what this will do is make the one shot glide to that note, sort of like you would glide an 808. Make sure to be careful with how long you 
like play that note like that gliding note if you make it like longer the note the gliding will like take longer to get to that note if you make it like shorter it would like immediately glide to that note so be careful with that let's start by adding some effects in the drums and maybe later some extra melodies but for now i think we have enough to like mess around with it Yo, they crazy. What I want to do with like this part of the melody is tweak it and make something like really unique. Um, so maybe add some filters to it, add some gross beat to it, half time, whatever. So I'm going to experiment with it and then I'll be back in a second. Let's maybe run this through Edison and lower down the sample rate and see how that sounds. So, thousand. Okay, that is sounding nice. I'm not going to lie. What I added is some tremolo um, with gross beat and I just pitched it up and that's how it sounds let's just structure the melody first i think we got like a decent amount of melodies and then add the drums so What I added to the guitar was just the same effect as the ARP, just some reels, delay, eternity, and fruity. And what I added to like the other melody is love filter, like these basic two, I think it is, yes. Um, and so it gives like that stuttering uh, effect and that will like really hit hard when the drums come in. Let's just go over to adding some drums So I want this part to go here and this part needs to be here. Um, let's add some 808s and some snares. This beat is just going to smack like.
think I'm going to pitch the melodies up and see how that sounds to give like uh, the low end inside of the beat a bit more room and also for like the 808 in a different key because sometimes certain 808s don't sound like that good in some keys so I'm going to pitch it up or down depending on what I like and let's get it. I want this to just be the first part um, that way it's like super bouncy with all the other drums and the melodies just like insane like i got no words for this beat this is really like my type of style i really like love this type of beats it just like the melody is dark it hits hard salsa if you're watching dm me just slide in my dm like we can work <laughs> i'm just joking but this video just shows you you can make like super hard beats with dark melodies but in a simple way because we only had like one chord progression with uh, like one counter melody and right now I have one, two, three, four, five, six different melodies in one beat so that's just crazy. But I hope you enjoyed it, I hope you learned from this as well. If you did, don't forget to leave a thumbs up. I'm active on social media, Skana Beats and I hope to see you in the next video guys, peace. Hey, yo, Skana, that you?